guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we have a try on haul. I waited a long time for this package to come because I live in the US and I'm pretty sure this is like a UK company or something. This is pretty little thing. I have a giant package right here. It is so heavy. I spent a lot of money, but I've never like spent this much money at once on clothes. I pretty much just did this for you guys because I know that Pretty Little Thing is like a bigger company on YouTube especially. And I'm here to just make a point that not everybody's body is small. And not everyone looks like the models on Pretty Little Thing or Fashion Nova. And like a lot of people on YouTube who, are, who do try on hauls for this are not plus size. So I'm here to do a plus size haul for you guys to show you what this stuff looks like on a body that's bigger. I was a little confused by the sizing. I got a size 12 in like everything. I didn't really know what that meant. It was just the biggest size, so that's what I got. Um, I don't think I got any specific like plus size items though, but I am plus size. So yeah, anyways, I'm already talking for too long, so let's just get honestly right into this video. I got like 17 items, so we really need to get into this. <laughs> so, I haven't really looked at anything in here. I did like poke a hole in just to peek in and just look <laughs> to make sure like everything was good but I haven't opened anything so let's just grab something and go so the first thing that I'm picking up here kind of is weird because it looks like it was like opened before it was like ripped and I didn't do that so when I did open my package to look at like what was in there this is the thing that I picked up and looked at but it was like open like this so that concerned me a little bit I was like did someone like return this and they just like threw it in my bag like, what is that about? The first thing that I ordered are these shorts. Let me make it darker. So the first thing that I ordered are these shorts right here, and they're like, they're kind of like a thin material, to be honest, but they look really short. Um, these are the Stone Stripe Frill Edge Shorts, and they were $12. I got a size large, I think, but in here it says medium, so I don't really know what that means, but I just thought they were really cute, and like, I wear shorts to bed a lot, so. I'll be wearing these to bed. They have like a frill on the bottom, but yeah. So that's the first thing that I got. We'll see how those fit. Okay guys, these are the shorts. They're really comfortable. They're really short, but they're so soft. Like honestly, I love them. And like my butt looks kind of good, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> they don't squeeze any of my fat right here. Like, I honestly really like them. Um, I love, like, the ruffles and stuff. And, yeah. I have nothing else to say. Like, these are awesome. They're really cute. They're really soft. And, yeah. I'm so excited about all of this. You guys have no idea. So, the next thing that I'm pulling out looks like it might be, like, a dress. So, this is a... I don't remember ordering this. Let me check my thing really fast because I really, like, just don't even remember seeing this. Okay, this is the black long sleeve bodycon dress, and this is only $8. So, from what I can see already, it, may, it looks like it may possibly be um, see-through. Because I can definitely see, like, my ring light through it, but I mean, obviously, it's, like, a really bright light. But it looks kind of short, so we're definitely going to see that with someone with, like, more of a curve and, like, a bigger bum. It's definitely long sleeve. Honestly, I wish I had this earlier, because... I went to a funeral today and I definitely could have wore this today instead of my outfit. But anyway, um, yeah, she looks, I mean, pretty cool. She looks pretty average. Again, I got all these in a size 12 and it looks like it's, that translates to a UK 16. So hopefully these things fit. I really don't know. Here's this black, like long sleeve dress. Um, it's really short. Like, my butt's gonna pop out if I even try to wear this in public. I don't know, like, it's just a black dress to me. The fabric is not the comfiest thing in the world. Like, putting my arms up, first of all, the dress comes up. Second of all, it just doesn't feel that comfortable. It's, like, really tight. But, like, not because it doesn't fit me, it's just the fabric, you know what I mean? just feels so tight to my skin. Kind of like a bathing suit material. Like, it's really strange. I don't remember if this was $8 or not, but I think it was definitely worth $8, if that makes any sense. Like, I wouldn't pay more than $8 for this, and I probably won't be wearing it. Kind of over this dress, I'm just gonna take it off. 
it's a no from me. Okay, so I was just looking in the mirror a little bit in this dress and actually it grew on me just a little bit. I don't know why, but just looking in the mirror like across over there. I know you guys can't really see me in this like terrible lighting, but it does kind of like accentuate my curves and I don't know about my butt. Honestly, the ring light like blinds me so much. I, I don't know, like I really don't know how I feel about this. The next thing we're pulling out, oh this, I remember this. So this is the overdressed slogan yellow oversized t-shirt and this was $15. <laughs> oh my God, this is like not my style, but I wanted to go out of my comfort zone with these and just get some things that weren't really my style. So this is this bright yellow shirt. It's like an oversized t-shirt. What is that? And it just says overdressed. And something about this just really called my name. I don't know what it was, but I don't know. I just like really enjoy that. Um, and I've been really enjoying yellow lately, so yeah. I mean, that's as basic as it gets. It's literally just a yellow t-shirt. Okay guys, I put the shorts back on for this, but I love this t-shirt. It's so oversized and nice. Um, I could wear it with some like leggings and just let it like hang down there. Just like go to the mall or something, roll the sleeves up. Cause it's really comfortable and I like my t-shirts to be really thin. And this definitely is nice and thin material. If you don't like that, then you wouldn't like that. But I personally like that. So yeah, yeah. Overdressed, hunty. Our next thing, oh I remember what this is, oh my god. This is another dress, just like another bodycon dress, but the straps are like diamonds. They're not like real diamonds. Ooh, hunty, well first of all, isn't that gonna be a little too long? I guess I ordered this like a little bigger, cause this is a size 14, which makes it a size UK 18, and it looks like it might be a little big for me. Um, but as you can see, like the diamonds are really, really pretty. They just look like rhinestones, nothing crazy. The dress is like a bodycon black short dress. Again, it looks kind of see-through, but um, if this doesn't fit me, it's totally my fault for like ordering a whole different size. I think I just did that just in case none of these other ones fit me though. So we'll see with that one. So that one's from the shape line. So I really wish I got that in a 12, but. So that is the shape black diamond taste strap bodycon dress and that was $15. Okay, I'm sorry for like totally flashing right now, but this dress literally just broke before my eyes. I don't know how to fix it. I wouldn't like wear a bra with this normally, but it's just cause it, it just broke. So I'm like annoyed, but whatever. I'm just annoyed because I was literally putting it on and the strap just broke so I can't even get a real like thought process around this okay so remember how I ordered this in, like a size bigger by accident it's literally smaller than any of the other dresses I've tried on so far and I know this is the shape wear section so maybe that's why it definitely fits though like around makes my butt look kind of good um, it doesn't make my stomach look good, but nothing makes my stomach look good. Overall, I could see how the shape thing... I have a mirror over here if you're wondering why I keep like looking over there. But I can see how they say it give you shape. I'm thinking I could take these off altogether and wear it as a strapless like dress. I could see that being a thing. Overall, annoyed. This is a lot of stuff. Okay, this next thing... Oh. I was pretty excited about these. <laughs> I feel like these are like something that's really popular for them. These are just the pretty little thing like leggings that you see everywhere. I just got the gray ones and they say pretty little thing across the top. They go around to the butt. Um, these look ooh, like they might be a little big for me. Some that's kind of concerning. But I guess now I know for next time if I ever want to order from them again, I know to get like maybe a size down. Have I been out of focus this whole time? Plus I'm like on a weight loss journey right now, so whatever, besides the point. But 
as you can see they're pretty long honestly they look like they might be a little too long for me I'm pretty short and my legs are pretty short so that's concerning they look a little big <laughs> something tells me it's not gonna flatter me very well those leggings were just a pretty little thing gray leggings and those are $25 so okay I cannot believe I'm showing this on the internet right now but it is absolutely atrocious like there's no better way to put it they literally just give you the worst love handles ever if you have love handles girl don't buy these seriously like I understand why skinny girls would like these but like girl those love handles no not to mention look at this baggy crotch like who wants that who wants that obviously they're like too big for me or whatever but like they're too big here but then they're too small here so like which one is it pretty little thing which one is it I don't really know how I feel about it <laughs> I don't know guys I might keep these Ugh, I'm annoyed I am very disappointed as of right now I was so excited for these these are probably like the thing I was most excited for because it's like their main thing I cannot believe these are $25 nope and let's also talk about the fact this is one of my pet peeves the ankle is not tight I like my ankles to be tight girl I like my ankles to be tight so I don't know Maybe if I do another Pretty Little Things video eventually, I will like get a different size in like the black or something and let you guys know. But these are a big no. Oh my god. Do that. That's how you can get it to not be like baggy though, but then it just looks weird if you fold it over. I don't know what the answer is. I'm done with these. Oh, I was so excited about these. Wait, there's like two things right here. Um. So these though, these I was so excited about because they're so out of my comfort zone. They are called the Black Tweed Check Paper Bag Skinny Pants and these are $25 as well. I really hope I end up wearing these. They're like not my style. Something I really like about the PLT website is that you can click an option to see like a catwalk version of the outfit instead of just looking at the picture. And like honestly that like really helps with your shopping experience because I almost didn't get these and then I watched the catwalk video of them and I was like I'm getting those like that just changed my mind I don't even know it just it's really enjoyable <laughs> okay I'm immediately noticing something pretty annoying about these and I'm kind of confused but anyways so these are it they're pretty much like a paper bag they're kind of messed up I'll show you guys in a second but a paper bag pant they're like plaid um, they're kind of cropped at the bottom so yeah but i really like this print this is like really me again i got these in a size 12 so uk 16 for those of you i don't think i have uk followers but if i do hey girl and it has a tie to go around the waist to cinch you in but okay what i'm noticing is just like it's really poorly made up here like okay if i was to just hold it like normally the little paper bag part just kind of folds in I'm not explaining this right. I'll try to show you guys in the try on. Now we are speaking my language. I love these. I love the crop on the ankle. I love how stretchy they are. Like, I'm sorry that someone's mowing outside, but um, I'm a big fan of like paperback things. So these, I just love. The thighs look good. Like, the butt I think it looks good it looks a little flat I don't know I really don't know let me put on like a crop top so here's what it would kind of look like with like a crop top um I don't know like something about it something about them are just really me they're like classy but also like edgy um don't laugh at my socks Oh, my really short legs but yeah 
these I will be keeping. Maybe I was so happy because like I was so unhappy with the other ones that I'm just really happy with these. I don't really know, girl. Also, I forgot to mention that you can tie this tie to like cover your fat stomach. <laughs> so, honestly, it's a win-win in my book. Okay, so the next thing that I got is a top. We haven't had any tops yet in this video. I don't even know if I ordered any other tops except for this one. This just looks to be a little crop top. Yep, it's just a little green crop top, to be honest. I have no idea why I ordered this. I don't wear stuff like this. But I was like, whatever. We're doing a try on haul. You might as well try everything for my girls and guys of the world. So yeah, um, oh, that thing smells weird, guys. This is the basic khaki jersey razorback crop top and she was $12. As for this top, I would not wear this bra under it. I would wear like a bralette so my boobs don't look as big, but I really like it. It's just like a top. I don't really wear crop tops because I'm just not a showy person, but honestly, I see nothing wrong with this. The back is just a razorback and yeah. I like it. Ooh, okay. I forgot about these. Um, I ordered these sunglasses, cause I mean, I wanted to order a little bit of everything, so I got an accessory. These are the black winged sunglasses, 12 bucks. By the picture and by just looking at it in the package, I can already tell that it kind of doesn't look the same, but I guess I'll have to take them out first. They're in like all this bubble wrap, which I appreciate. So what I can see from the picture is that these are just like really big, like black sunglasses. They kind of remind me of like Jeffree Star. I'm gonna need scissors for this, which I'm kind of annoyed about. Okay. Ooh. I have a really small head, it's really hard for me to find sunglasses, and I can already tell these are way too big for me. Like, they literally just fall off. But for pictures and stuff, I guess. How do you guys feel? <laughs> I don't know. I had to see, like, in my phone, I guess. She's not bad. Should we keep her up here for the vid? <laughs> Honestly, I'm really not mad at them. Um, I'm really not like, I was expecting them to become like defaulted or something, but honestly, they're not that bad. If you're just like running out of the house and you need some sunglasses to like cover your entire face because you just don't want to be seen by the public, these are for you. On to the next. These are when. For the first thing we tried on, oh, I was so excited about this because I'm a basic girl, so anything like this, you know I'm gonna love it. But um, this is a hoodie, or a, a pullover, whatever you wanna call it, because it doesn't have a hood technically, but I got a gray hoodie thing. Well, I hope this isn't like way too big, but it just says California, and if you know me in real life or anything about me, you know that I love California, I love everything about California, I want to live in California, it is like my dream. I mean, I'm from like Pennsylvania, so <laughs> it's really boring here. I just love cities, like I love people, I don't love people, but I don't know how to explain it guys. I belong in California, okay? Anyway, how much was this? This is the gray Marl California slogan oversized sweater and this was $28 yeah it just says California West Coast I'm like actually obsessed with this I think I'm gonna wear this like way too much the back is just plain it's so comfortable feeling guys how's the inside how's the inside yes just how I like them I wear these like there's literally one right behind my camera like I was just wearing it earlier before I put this on but anyway yeah this seems like a win-win to me I mean yeah, I'm in love. Guys, this is a win for me without even thinking about it because I love big manly sweaters because I'm a manly gal. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But, um, okay. California, it's gray. It's comfortable. I don't really know what else to say about it. Like, I just really like it. I don't really know how to explain it. I'm so hyper right now. That's the culprit. But anyways, um, okay. Why do you guys watch my channel? Like, I'm so weird. But anyways, there's 
nothing to say about this. It's perfect. It cinches in right here at the waist, so like, you don't have like a hanging situation. Here's what the back looks like in case anyone's wondering. It is like, kind of bulky, but I mean, it is what it is. And also, it's really warm. So, I might have to wait till like the quarter months to actually wear this. I don't really know. But this is well worth $25 or $28, whatever it was in my book. I love it. Okay, I'm pulling this out because I know exactly what this is. Because I would never order something like this otherwise. This is a bodysuit. And I ordered many bodysuits because I just love bodysuits. They're just my thing. This one just happened to catch my eye. It's like nude. I don't want everywhere nude. It has like this clasp at the front. It's like metal. I think it actually zips. So if you're trying to be like sexy or whatever, um, it really zips down. So it's pretty, you know, pretty normal. And then of course it has the little bodysuit thing. Yeah, again, it's pretty basic. This is the shape. Oh, this is from the shapewear too. I was really interested in the shape wear um, section of PLT because I have shape, so I think it would benefit me. <laughs> but I didn't order that much, unfortunately. But shape, nude, ribbed, ring, pool, bodysuit. This was $18. I don't feel like putting pants on, so we're just gonna view this bodysuit without pants on from up here. But as you can see, I don't remember if this is from the shape line or not, but if it is, I can like tell. It really accentuates my shape and I really appreciate that. So yeah, it is a little more like boob than I would typically wear though. So I'm not sure how I feel about that because like usually I would prefer to be more like up there, but it is what it is. Um, yeah, it's really soft, it's really nice and I like that little touch and overall, I'm not mad at it and I probably will wear it. Something red, I don't remember what this is. I think it's a dress. Yep. So again, out of my comfort zone, this just looks to be a very sexy, like, V plunge bodycon dress. Pretty short, just a mini dress. It's so soft, oh my god. I can imagine myself like a night on the town with my friends that don't exist wearing this. <laughs> So this is only $8. This is the basic red extreme plunge strappy bodycon dress. And it was $8, so honestly I'm not even mad at that at all. It's literally really soft. I'm kind of excited to wear it, so please fit me. And like actually make me look good. I'm not gonna wear shapewear with any of this while I try it on. Just gonna put my body on the internet. <laughs> I mean, yes. For their like $8 stuff, I know I have like a pooch, but I mean, it is what it is. Ew, it looks like I'm like pregnant, no. But like, I don't know. Like something about Pretty Little Thing makes you like really feel yourself. As for like the shape, and the V is not too low. It isn't too low and then this whole shape thing is really nice. As for this, I'm kind of mad at that. I can just go to the gym, that's like completely my fault. It's not the dress's fault that I have a tummy. It is really short in the back. I really like it. I have really nothing terrible to say about it, except for the pooch. But anyways, this is worth $8. Next thing, it's another dress, because I can tell by what it is. I remember what this is too. This one I'm iffy about, to be honest. I remember getting this because the model looked like so darn good in the picture and I was like, can I look like that? <laughs> but I'm not gonna look like that, so. This was um, $25, it was ribbed, button, detail, mi midi dress. For 25, how much was this? I mean, why did I do that? <laughs> like if I spent $8 for that dress, why did I spend 25 for this one? I feel like PLT is kind of like all over the place. Like I saw some stuff on there for like 160, but then you have like an $8 dress and then this is like 25. It's like, what is your price range? Whatever though. So here's the dress, she's black. Oh, she's longer. So she's not like, why am I calling a dress a she? So it's not like that, like short, like the other ones that I got. Okay, she's classy girl. <laughs> it has buttons going all the way down. As you can see, it's pretty long. I would call this a midi dress. 
wow oh i hope this looks good because honestly kind of obsessed it's not see-through this one does not look like it is gonna be see-through i finally managed to get the dress on like pretty little things sizing is so like off because some things fit me and then some things don't i was like busting at the seams for the first button so i had to undo that but <sighs> other than that this dress like really sucks all your fat in so it's really good and it really fits well i don't know what size i got in this i think it was like a 12 but and it goes down really far it goes down like past right past your knee so you could definitely wear this for like special occasions unfortunately i'm short so this kind of thing looks really weird on me <laughs> like honestly it looks quite strange but it just does not really flatter me at all and like I said, I'll show you guys what it looks like when I button this. Like, that's what happens when I button the first button. It just, like, busts. So, maybe if I just wasn't wearing a bra or something, it wouldn't do that. But I don't know. It's like, it's really well made. It was pretty hard to get on because the material is so thick. But it's definitely not my favorite dress that I got of the day. The next thing we have is, looks like, oh, it's a bodysuit. It's not a dress, guys. Oh, I know what this is. Okay, so, let's see. I'm pretty sure this is just the off-the-shoulder bodysuit. It's the basic black bar dot baby suit in this baby suit? Body suit, and it was $12. It looks like it might be small to me, so this one I actually have concerns about. My arms are huge. My arms don't play games. So we'll see about this, but I mean the torso looks long enough for me. The off the shoulder looks pretty good, it's pretty tight. Um, actually, I don't know. We'll just have to see. To be honest, I, this one I don't really have anything to say about about it. It uh, it looks pretty average. So we'll just have to see how it looks on. As for this bodysuit, it's really nice. I really like it. I just need to figure out a bra situation because. Literally, I'm pretty sure you can see right through it. I guess if you can see my stuff, I'll have to edit this part out, but um, I really, really like this top. It's a bodysuit and like something about it. I just really like, like the sh these are really tight and like I have trouble with that since usually when I get shirts like this, I have to get like, I have to get like an extra extra large which makes this part really big and not very flattering. So yeah, I don't know. But it definitely is a little see-through. So if you're going to wear this out, you have to wear a bra, unfortunately. I just don't like bras. Yeah. We love this shirt. It's really, really cute. Next thing. <laughs> um, what are you? What is this? I need to look <laughs> what I bought. Because honestly, I don't know what this is supposed to be. It's like... Okay, maybe it's a dress that I tie. I think that is, I guess. Yeah, it's the black halter neck bodycon dress. $8. <laughs> I think I was just buying stuff that was $8 just to buy stuff that was $8 because it was $8. You know what I mean? The whole back is out. You guys can't see this until the try on because it's just hard to show you. But it's like halter neck, so you tie it. <sighs> Why? Why do I do this to myself? And then this is where the back is. I can't. This is so hard to show. Oh my god. It is really soft though. It has the exact same soft material as the other $8 dress. Honestly, like, I really like it. It feels so free. I could really imagine myself wearing this in the summer. Even though the summer just ended. It's like pretty short, but it goes on like really low on the back. Um, again, it's like slightly see-through. So I don't know. It does nothing for my stomach. It makes my stomach look terrible. We're coming to a halt, guys. We have like three or two more things. This is another red thing. Apparently I was feeling real frisky with my red, I guess, but. Did I order this? <laughs> this is like a couple weeks ago, guys, so I really don't remember. Okay, I did. It just doesn't, it's not what I thought it was gonna be. But this is the Burgundy Strappy Plunge Wrap Dress Body Con Dress, $25. I 
I'm gonna put the picture up. You guys tell me if this, if it looks like it was gonna be like a bandage type of dress. It's really not though. Um, it's this burgundy like dress that has some ruching on it. It's definitely like, I would call this a mini dress or maybe a midi. I don't know what to think. This is not what I was expecting, but maybe it'll look good on me. Who really knows? It's like a slinky material, which I'm not a fan of already. Pretty sure it'll compliment my body though. And yeah, it's growing on me. Actually, the more I look at it, it's definitely growing on me. It's just not what I thought it would be. Hey guys, this is my favorite dress thus far. It is pretty flattering on my body overall. Like, I really like it. And honestly, the when I put it on, like, my body and I'm not just looking at it I can tell that it does look more like the picture that they have um I don't know I love how it just like crisscrosses right there the bust is a little big for me but um I can work with that the back is pretty short it's pretty short from the back but I don't know it's a pretty nice dress I really like maroon maroon is always like my color <laughs> There's nothing else to really say about it. It's a nice dress. It's kind of flattering in all the right places, and I think it's nice. More black. <laughs> My life. This is a bodysuit. I think I know exactly what this is. I'm so excited for it. This is pretty much like the same exact thing that I'm wearing right now. This is a black roll neck long sleeve bodysuit, $18. So it's like a turtleneck type of thing. And it's a bodysuit. So it's a long sleeve black turtleneck bodysuit. There's really nothing else to say about it, guys, <laughs> to be honest with you. And it's always good to have stuff like this because, you know, I mean, I'm literally wearing one right now. Okay, guys, this is the last bodysuit. I'm not complaining. I like everything about it. It's really sleek. Um, this is my style. Like everything else you saw in this haul is not my style. This is my style. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's a wee tiny bit see-through. But I mean, it's a nice thin material, so I expect that from this. If I like pull it, you can definitely see my bra through that. But then again, I have a ring light right here, so. <laughs> I don't know, but. I kind of love it. <laughs> it's the last thing, guys, and it looks... Wait. Did I order two of these? <laughs> oh my god. I really did. I ordered two of these shirts. Not one, but two. So... I'm confuzzled now. How did I do that? I don't know. So now we have two of these shirts. This is going straight on Poshmark. So if you want a really cheap shirt from Pretty Little Thing, brand new, size 12, UK 16, go to my Poshmark, link below. Literally using my flashlight, but so I'm editing right now and I just realized like, I already had all these pictures laid out that I'm going to, like, put in the video of the items. And I'm looking at it, and I'm like, wait, I didn't get this dress, this one dress. So, it's almost like they changed my order to, like, two of those green shirts instead of that dress. I don't know. I'm really annoyed, though, because I kind of really wanted that dress, but whatever. I'm sad, no, that's everything. But I need to go try everything on now. So I'll be back for my final thoughts after I try everything on because I want to give like a real thought process to end the video, so I'll be back. We're kind of running out of time to do an, in to do an extensive like thought process of the entire Pretty Little Thing experience. I can tell you guys that I really enjoyed most of these clothes. I will wear a lot of them. I probably will shop there again. Everything is like pretty cheap for what it is. If you guys want to do a pretty little thing shoe haul, I kind of really want to do that. So let me know. I don't know what else to say, but I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
You guys are so beautiful and I love you and I loved making this video. If you want more videos like this, let me know. I would love to do it. It was definitely some cash, so uh, I should probably get a job. But yeah, um, I love you guys. You're beautiful and good bye. <laughs>